Hey friends, in this video, I will show you how we can check all Active Directory port status with a single PowerShell command. Because if you are checking each and every port uh, one by one, so it will take uh, uh, some times. But uh, in this video, I will show you how we can check these all ports with a single PowerShell, uh, PowerShell command and PowerShell script. Uh, basically, as you are aware that Active Directory port is very important to to run the Active Directory services in your infrastructure for domain client communications or domain uh, server member servers communications. So what we need to do, we need to just open the PowerShell ISC. Even you can open it the PowerShell as well. Here I need to put the PowerShell command. So I'm just entering the PowerShell for each. I, this is a, a loop for each loop and uh, and I am just uh, putting a variable port in 135, so these all ports are very important if you uh, if you are just running the active directory in your infrastructure so these ports must be uh, open and must be uh, must be uh, working fine then only your active directory services will run smoothly so now i just created a for for each loop and in this loop i just created a variable and assign the value in the variable for all ports now i will open a curly braces over here now if and close it here I need to put the a new variable in this variable I will specify the test net connection this is a PowerShell command to check the uh, port connectivity and now I need to put port this is also a part of testnet connection which ports you want to check so you just want to check the value for port variable so i will specify port this is the variable which i created now i will show the warning action warning action silently continue it will, it will silently continue for each and every port in the loop and uh, TCP test succeeded equal to specify the variable true and this process will be closed we'll start over here and i'm just specifying the message tcp port and uh, it will show the message for each port which is mentioned inside the dollar port is connecting and then i will close this I will close this and uh, this is closed now and again this should be closed so this is the port this is the PowerShell command you need to put over here. I'm just explaining about the things what we did. So I just created a for each loop and in this loop I just um, using a, a variable dollar uh, port and in this variable I specified the port number for Active Directory. So you must be aware about these ports. And now I'm just uh, asking that to check the testnet connection and here I need to specify the computer name of the domain controller so first we need to check the host name this is the host name of your 
domain controller to which you want to check the port. So I am just checking the port which is opened on the info SRV01. So I need to specify the host name over here, host name or you can also specify the IP address as well. This is the computer name to which we just want to check the port status. Now I will execute this command. So if port will work, then it will show the TCP port is connecting. So I'm just executing this one by one. It will check the port status. You can see this is just processing and it is just checking the response from this server. Info SRV01, yes, this port is working fine. So now you see this is the method which you can use to check all the, t all the ports uh, for Active Directory. So this uh, PowerShell will not only helpful to checking the Active Directory port, but even you can also specify some other ports for other servers as well. Simultaneously, you can check each and every port status of your infrastructure for any servers, either that is open or that is work, that is not uh, working. So this can be clarified with a single PowerShell command. Thank you for watching this video.